So this is the newest design. It's just an interchangeable barrel that I attached. Uh, it's actually off a paintball gun. It's a 14 inch. Calling it the blunderbuss. Got it loaded up with a uh, large chrome steel ball bearing. Uh, it doesn't fit perfectly in the barrel so I had to use some wadding around the ball bearing and also behind it but I got it pumped up to 380 PSI and we're going to take a shot at that uh, Dell laptop so let me get it set up and we'll go from there. Alright so this is my first time shooting this so I'm going to be kind of close here. Uh, like I said 380 PSI large steel chrome ball bearing against the uh, Dell Inspiron that I had shot at earlier with the smaller chrome ball bearings. Um, gonna try once again to do this one-handed so here we go Let's go take a look So, went in there, I'm not sure if it's still stuck in there. As per usual, I will pause this and we will take a look, see if I can find it and what the damage is. So opening it up, there's what it did to the inside of the screen. And it had left a trail of glass and other remnants there. I believe that the steel bob bearing actually bounced off the screen. Um, it's actually, I mean, that's quite a bit of force and actually it did end up also denting the track pad and uh, cracked the plastic there. Not sure where the ball bearing went. I'm gonna see if I can find it. So, stay put. So, here's a quick update. I came back out to uh, check out the laptop again and I found the ball bearing. There it is. So it did end up staying inside there. Maybe I'll pull this uh, plastic cover off and see what kind of damage it actually did. So, all right, uh, I'll probably be in a, in a different video maybe tomorrow or the next day. So, 